Commander, that was a skillful operation back on Sir Kesh, extracting the female Krogan. I had help. Morden Solis knew what he was doing. Yes, Garrus mentioned the Doctor was on your mission through the Omega-4 relay. I'm surprised the Solarian cares about the Krogan. War is full of surprises. <laughs> Rarely the good kind. I'm just happy this one played to our advantage. That's all. Of course, Commander.
Need something, Shepard? That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Uh, yeah. Something wrong? Morden. He got his tissue sample from me, all right. Let's just say scalpels were never meant to cut where he cut. When this war is over, I hope we find every race that sat back while we bled and get some payback. Yeah, that's a great plan. Follow war with more war. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games are built from that interface? You play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy, though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite back home. I like the feel of something solid in my hands. Well, now that I know your weakness, we may have to try a game. <laughs> It'd be more fun than playing Edie. Edie doesn't sweat. You sweat playing chess? Depends on how much fun we're having. Commander? Don't worry, Edie. Once the Krogan are gone, we'll get rid of the smell. While this body has olfactory sensors, I do not have positive or negative associations with any specific scent. Oh. Well, lucky you. Commander? So the Reapers did not fully exterminate their creators. That suggests they are fallible, even on large or long-term scales. Shepard, you are staring. Crazy of me to ask you to join the Normandy back then. But I let you down. I let Shepard down. I let everyone listed on that memorial wall down. You had the courage to support Shepard. Joker did. Garrus and Tally did. But Ashley didn't. Liara didn't. Were they cowards? I think not. Greg, you're one of the bravest and most loyal men I know. You were meant to be here, right now. We have a war to win, so clear your head and focus. <laughs> okay, okay, you win. It will not be mentioned again. Commander? Hello, Commander. Shepard, I looked over your mission report. Gotta say, it feels like we've been after these Reapers forever. From Sovereign to Leviathan, they've been a pain in the ass the whole time. But at least we're starting to see the big picture. Never really thought we'd get any answers. Doesn't change much, but it does make this war feel a whole lot bigger. Maybe later. Say that again? The population of the colony world of Tyvor has been killed. I don't understand. The Reapers have been taking people alive. It was self-inflicted. When Reaper forces invaded, Tyvor's colonists detonated nuclear weapons inside their cities. Goddess. Their deaths would have been instantaneous, Doctor. Thank you, Glyph. That'll be all.
busy? I have time if you'd like to talk. In fact, I could use the distraction. What's on your mind? How long it took the Reapers to eradicate the Protheans, and how long they'll need for us. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. We're not quite so widespread, but it would still take at least 100 years. It's selfish, but I keep thinking that if we fail, I'm only 109, Shepard. I could live to see the entire cycle come to an end. Only 109, huh? I know. It must seem strange to complain about a thousand-year lifespan. I used to think it was sad that most aliens live such short lives. Maybe it's not such a privilege to outlive so many. To witness so much death. Don't drive yourself crazy about this, Liara. We're still in the fight. Only because you're still driving it forward. We finally have other leaders on our side, but... None will take us as far as you can. Sometimes I wonder how you do it. I think of the people I care about. That helps keep me going. I'm glad I'm among them. I hope. Of course you are. I feel better already. Thank you for coming by, Shepard. Why don't we talk later? I can only imagine talking to something so huge, so alien. I hope it helps against the Reapers. Working on anything? I'm helping decode some of the Crucible's designs, or trying to. Theoretical particle physics based on specialized base 12 mathematics aren't exactly my specialty. And Javik is his usual forthcoming self. I'd trade my last hundred years to resurrect even one Prothean scientist to help us. Thanks for coming by. Greetings, Commander. I studied your human religions, Commander. Your devil and his fall. Leviathan and its kind deserve the same fate. They once unleashed a plague that has haunted all of our history to this day. I say their own hell is the abyss you found them in. One I hope they never escape from. It seems you believed Protheans built the mass relays. The Reapers are cunning in their deception. Allowing life to flourish, century upon century. Letting us believe ourselves the masters of the cosmos. Then the truth becomes known. There are monsters in the dark spaces. And we are their prey. Your Liara Asari asks many questions. You would think she'd never seen a Prothean before. Commander. Kenneth? Do you ever think about when we were abducted by... No, I don't. Me neither. Hey, Esteban, for your shuttle being so stealthy and all, you sure do get shot at a lot. Well, the UT-47A stealth systems only internalize heat and high band emissions. So while few sensors can pick us up, our cover is blown as soon as someone looks up. Time for an upgrade. Most scanners and tracking systems don't operate in mid-range frequencies. Sure, maybe we've been shot at, but we haven't been shot down. Yet. Lucky for us, you're almost as good a pilot as you think you are. Well, yeah. There's that, too. Can't say I was happy sending you down in that submersible by yourself. Don't know why I ever worry about you. Take on ancient aliens from the deep? Sure, no problem. Everything is in order. With the Leviathan on our side, maybe we pull this thing off after all. Maybe, James. At least Anne's still around to see her dad's work finally pay off. Do you hear that hum? Is that just me? 